Hey y'all, hey. If you are struggling with how to pair a white blazer, make it pop, or just make a white blazer pop with color, then this video is for you. Let's get into it. Before we get into it, all thanks to God for allowing me to be able to create this video and for allowing me the skills to even do this video, all thanks to God. I got this white blazer from um, H&M for $8, original price $50. I am a Clarence girly. I just wanted to give y'all some simple outfit ideas that y'all could easily put together or find somewhere to mimic and put your own little spin to it. For the first outfit, first up is actually the outfit that I have on, this white blazer um, from H&M, this express crop top extra large and these high-waisted pants that the reason that I love them so much if you have a big bottom I love that this has the little gap thing in the back that stops the gap from happening and I paired this with a gold watch gold necklace um, gold hoop earrings and a ice cream cone brooch to just add a little bit of flair to it and if you are a pear shaped body, high waisted um, hands are going to be perfect for you. I cannot tell you how that just makes your waist cinch in, but it also shows your figure in a flattering way. Also, if you have a little tummy, which I do, it doesn't accentuate the tummy, but actually complements it. You are a short person <laughs> watching this video. High waisted hands elongate your legs. So if you're already tall like me, it's elongating your legs even more. And I added, put on kitten heels with a pointy toe. Something about a pointy toe kitten heel at the end of pants just makes the outfit just more chic and popping in my opinion. And I paired this with the metallic, I think Mark James Mark. Not Mark Jacobs, but Mark New York something purse to just put the whole look together. I like pairing same colors together, but in different shades or variations. I could you could do this with any color. So if you wanted to do a purple under and just add the white blazer, it will work well with any color. If you're needing something that's easy to put together white blazer pop of color they do not have to be the same shade of blue and some kitten heels preferably white or cream this could be this outfit could be worn for a casual day or a night out with friends and it is comfortable okay styling and profiling with simplicity that is what i always aim to do i always say if it's hard if it's got me thinking too long it's got me thinking wrong Especially when I'm shopping, I don't need to get it. But let's go to the to the next one. The next look I absolutely love. So I have a black corset on with green high-waisted shorts that I got from New York and Company in a size 1X. And I paired this with the white blazer, but also changed the brooch to be a gold brooch with gold embellishment. Well, a gold circular brooch. Bro a gold circular brooch with black embellishment and I paired this with my zebra print chunky block heels just to add a little bit of flair and I also grabbed my Jason Wu bag with the same gold jewelry to add it together I'm a gold person girl with hoop earrings especially with this type of hairstyle that I am wearing now I feel like the pop of color just brings a little bit of more of a story to the outfit. If you haven't watched my channel, I am a color person. I love to have on a, a pop of color because why not? I feel that this outfit will definitely have you stand out in the room because of the color and how it's looking. I feel the corset just complements the whole outfit it just ties in together so well and adding a little bit of texture and patterns to this outfit with the zebra print chunky heels is just chef kiss so for this third look i changed up the blazer from the h&m blazer to my banner republic blazer 
And I got this blazer in a size 18. And I will say, if you go to Banana Republic and you're searching online and you're not able to try it on, I would definitely, if it's a size up, get it because their size 18s fit so differently. Like this blazer fit me, but the other blazers in the size 18 were not, I'll say arm, if you have big arms like me, they were not big arm friendly. So it's like select a few. But this blazer, I call this is my dressy white blazer. And this is what I would wear if I wanted to dress up or wear heels. The white, the other white blazer is more of a casual and it can be dressy look. And I love this blazer for its gold embellishment. So I wanted to accentuate that, make that the pop out piece for this outfit, which I paired with shorts from Lane Bryant that I have in a size 20. And I do have a lot of room. I got them for Goodwill for $5. That's why I got them. <laughs> <laughs> but it has a lot of room so I definitely could have did my regular size 18 with these gold chunky heels and I have on these pearl earrings to make this outfit dressy and I didn't add a brooch because the blazer is already doing enough that is the statement piece and I paired it with a gold clutch next outfit is very very casual it's the same outfit just I switched the blazer so we have the Lane Bryant shorts we have the white dress crop top and uh, no brooch this time because this is a casual look and I paired this with my Sam Alderman slides just to give it casual and this one I switched the bags so y'all can see with the bamboo and with the Jason Wu snake print uh, pink purse that I have. And I honestly like the Jason Wu one better, but this outfit I wanted to showcase a casual, comfortable look. You could wear this outfit to a brunch, a girl's day out, a girl's day out. Like this outfit is comfortable because you're wearing white sandals. You can go, I think you could just <laughs> wear this outfit anywhere probably not a professional dressy event but definitely throughout the day if you're not doing anything run errands go, this will definitely do it for you and this a bamboo clutch i got at a thrift store i don't know if it's vintage or not but i got it at a thrift store and it was only uh five dollars by j renee and it's great great quality uh, i'm so happy that i found that fine because it's a great statement piece I love this look for you and for me because of how effortlessly it is to put together. You can find some white sandals, you can find some shorts, a white crop top, and a white blazer and just be on your way. Just simple and get your jewelry to accessorize and style the outfit and you're going to be doing a damn thing. Period. So let's step into the wild side into the animal kingdom <laughs> so i didn't know how this outfit would look honestly i was just thinking about oh let me just give it a try because y'all i really love these pants that i found at banana republic the balloon high-waisted pants in a tall i was like i have to get them and i have to get them altered in the back because they have a gap but i said these it was a good deal they were only like seven dollars at Banana Republic. I got these balloon pants that I absolutely love in white and this cheetah print belt. Got the cheetah print belt from Gap and I wanted to pair it with my cheetah print heels and my cheetah print flats with this white blazer. And I also have a cheetah print scarf. That's why I said, welcome to the wild side y'all, okay? Welcome to the wild side. <laughs> I got this belt and I'm like trying it on Y'all see the outfit, y'all see it. It's giving what it's supposed to give. I want to show y'all the versatility. These heels are comfortable, but if you are a flat wearing girl, and I know a lot of these uh, style videos, they always have on heels. So I wanted to make an intentional effort to show a variation of you can wear this with flats and you can wear this with heels. And it's simple. I wanted to do it all white with the blazer. And doing all white and styling your accessories can make any outfit pop. I decided to wear bigger earrings, especially when I wear a head wrap, you have to wear big earrings. You have to wear a statement earrings so they can be seen. This outfit will help you make a bold statement. Not doing too much, but you're but you loud. Okay? 
Next outfit is a very simple, effortless outfit that does just enough but not too much and you gonna stand out. I did pair this with my white express crop top, some old navy jeans that I have in a 18 tall with my white Salomon fly sandals. And an auto bag that has pink, orange, yellow, and white in it. This gives me very casual and comfortable, but if I needed to dress up, I could. Also want to show you the versatility in it by pairing it with these gold, gold slip-ons from Birdie that are very, very comfortable. So if you are interested in getting those, I highly recommend because they are super comfortable and stylish. And I wanted to show you all the different variations of how this can be casual. The sandals are casual too, but it adds a little bit of a more dressier tone to it versus the gold slip-on sneakers that I'm showing y'all. Which shoes do y'all prefer for this outfit? But I love this outfit for its simplicity. I paired this with pink earrings just to pop out the bag even more. And even if I didn't have my bag on, I would wear the pink earrings just to add a little pop of color. This is definitely perfect for a night out in the city with your girls, with yourself, going to the library. But I always say you can look good anywhere. You don't need a special occasion to get dressed up. Next outfits. I won't say I'm a sneakers girl, but my husband buys me a lot of sneakers. And I shall utilize my sneakers. And I am pairing with the white blazer, I'm choosing to focus on my shoes being the, the excitement of this outfit, which are some black, red, and white Air Jordans with a khaki pin from Old Navy, the same collection as the blue trousers, and a black skinny belt, white blazer, and the white crop top with gold accessories, but also making sure to use big hoop earrings for this outfit. No brooch because this is just a simple, I would call this outfit streetwear chic. <laughs> We're gonna call it streetwear chic because of the tennis shoes. I feel like you can definitely wear this outfit to corporate work day because it's still dressy, but you can still be comfortable. You don't have to put on the heel. Always aim to be comfortable. At the end of the day, the day gonna end, but at least you is comfortable, okay? Last but not least, and definitely not the worst, I have this outfit that I absolutely love. I actually, it's actually Pinterest inspired. It's giving me classy, giving me classic elegance, especially because of the kitten heels. So I decided to pair this with a black top. Old Navy skinny jeans that were mentioned before because we like to repurpose clothing items. I like to wear my clothing over and over and over again in different <laughs> variations. We accented it with a brooch, gold jewelry, same gold jewelry, Kitten Hill from Nine West with a pointy toe just to add a little bit extra elegance to it. And these jeans are high-waisted. And I decided to pair this with my Ralph Lauren snake print purse. It just really brought the outfit together. You can't tell me not a damn thing that I don't look good. And you will too if you mimic this outfit. Once again, it's simple. You can find a white blazer. You can find a black top. Get some gold jewelry from the thrift store. Ken Hills, Target has them. I was lucky enough to find these at Goodwill. Definitely go to your local thrift stores. This outfit is simple, but it's loud. And it gives very classy, modest, and it shows your figure if you need to. If you do get hot, you can always take the blazer off. <laughs> you can always take the white blazer off. This outfit for me gives timeless and it's perfect for any occasion. All purpose outfit in regards to the events you can go to. You need to go out, date night, hang out with friends, go to a networking event. This will be the outfit that I will put on and wear. There you have it. I 
outfit I did is the style white blazer for a pear body shape and especially if you are tall and curvy like me that will not only make you look good but feel good grow your confidence have you stepping into to the room like hold on let me show you who said it oh that's the opportunity for me oh thank you i'll take that okay <laughs> and remember that it's all about finding items that highlight your best features shout out to a subscriber a supporter that told me i was an hourglass but pear shape and that has helped me elevate my wardrobe even more thanks for hanging out with your girl and don't forget to like comment and subscribe and let me, let me know in the comments which outfit was your favorite or which one you will be trying okay all right y'all bye i'll see y'all in the next video this one right here just know that you are wonderfully and beautifully made in god's image